Glory to God. May God bless you, may God keep you, may the Lord protect you. Another Powerful Prayer Today, we are on the fifth day of prayer, in our War Room campaign. I am sure that the Holy Trinity will bless you and grant you victory. Today, we will make a powerful prayer. We will pray three psalms. And these three prayers, these three psalms, will help you in any area of your life where you are making this purpose, in this campaign. This purpose is a purpose of spiritual battle. Those who are experiencing any uprising from the enemy in any area of their life. We will pray Psalms 23, 91, and 121. Repeat all the prayers with me with great faith, and I believe that many good things from God are coming to you. Amen. Let's pray. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures, He leads me beside quiet waters, He refreshes my soul, He guides me along the right paths, for His name's sake, even though I walk, through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me, in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows, surely goodness and mercy will follow me, all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord, forever. Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God, in whom I trust. Surely He will save you from the fowler's snare and from the deadly pestilence. He will cover you with His feathers, and under His wings you will find refuge, His faithfulness will be your shield and rampart. You will not fear the terror of night, nor the arrow that flies by day, nor the pestilence that stalks in the darkness, nor the plague that destroys at midday. A thousand may fall at your side, ten thousand at your right hand, but it will not come near you. You will only observe with your eyes and see the punishment of the wicked. If you say, The Lord is my refuge, and you make the Most High your dwelling. No harm will overtake you, no disaster will come near your tent. For He will command His angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. They will lift you up in their hands, so that you will not strike your foot against a stone. You will tread on the lion and the cobra, you will trample the great lion and the serpent. Because He loves me, says the Lord, I will rescue Him, I will protect Him, for He acknowledges my name. He will call on me, and I will answer Him, I will be with Him in trouble, I will deliver Him and honor Him. With long life I will satisfy Him and show Him my salvation. I lift up my eyes to the mountains, where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, the Maker of heaven and earth. He will not let your foot slip, he who watches over you will not slumber. Indeed, he who watches over Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord watches over you, the Lord is your shade at your right hand. The sun will not harm you by day, nor the moon by night. The Lord will keep you from all harm, He will watch over your life. The Lord will watch over your coming and going both now and forevermore. Our Lord God and our beloved and dear Father. Father, bless, Lord, all your sons and daughters who are in this prayer campaign. Your word says, My Father, enter your room, close the door, and pray. And your Father who sees in secret will reward you openly. I believe, my Father, that you will honor your sons, I believe that you will honor your daughters, that a day of victory will come into the lives of your children. Bless, Father, all those who have made their intentions with you at this moment. Bless and grant victory in the name of the Lord Jesus. Pray with me. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, 
and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, the glory for ever and ever. Amen. Glory to God.